Hey, how you doing everybody? This is Rick Savage with another installment of my Selfie Stick History Series. Today I am in Danville, Virginia, which for among other things is known as the last capital of the Confederate States of America. On April 2nd, 1865, the forces of General Ulysses S. Grant overran the forces of General Robert E. Lee at the uh, Siege of Petersburg. Lee was forced to evacuate south, the hope being that he could connect with the Confederate Army of Joseph E. Johnston in North Carolina so that they could continue prosecuting the war. Confederate President Jefferson Davis got to Danville on April 3rd, 1865, a day after Petersburg was evacuated. Danville had been chosen prior as a location for the Confederate government to move, was Richmond ever to be evacuated. Davis arrived and he would stay at the Sutherland Mansion, which was the home of William T. Sutherland, who had been the mayor of Danville and also was a uh, tobacco. He owned a huge tobacco warehouse. The Sutherland Mansion is behind me. And if you can see it, that is the Sutherland Mansion as it is today. Today it houses uh, a historical and art society. But Jefferson Davis would come here with all of his cabinet minus his Secretary of War, John C. Breckinridge, who was still on his way from Richmond. So Davis would have his last cabinet meeting here. He would also send out his last proclamations as the Confederate president. So this house behind me, the Sutherland Mansion, actually is called the last capital of the Confederacy and pretty much the last White House of the Confederacy. On April 10th, a day after Lee surrendered to Grant at Appomattox, Davis and whoever was left with him fled south by train. They called it the flight into oblivion because that was pretty much it. And he was eventually captured in Georgia and would spend the next couple of years in prison in Maryland. And the Civil War, of course, pretty much was over April 9th, 1865. So all of this was kind of, uh, kind of a waste at that point. But the point of being here is, this is the last capital, last White House of the Confederacy. And even though, even though it's not politically correct in this ignorant world we live in of people that have absolutely no idea how to interpret history, you were here because I'm here, because where I go, you go. Get it? Boom, baby!